If, if you were here a while ago, our famous phrase was, we're here to invade our city. Now, that sounds amazing, and it sounds spiritual, and it's very biblical, but when you're not the one doing the invading, it's a little bit awkward and odd. It's like, whoa, whoa, because if you look at history, the church is famous for invading, and the fruits of it weren't that awesome. The fruits of it were superior, arrogant Christianity. And we started making everybody look like us. And that's not, that's not who we are. That's, that's not what we're designed to do. We are not, that is not why we're here. So we had to grow up a little bit. It doesn't mean that invasion was wrong. It just means I, you'd be amazed at how much tension in the body of Christ is literally over a few words. Terminology. Like if you didn't use that word and used this word, heart's still the same. It's just a different word. You'd be amazed at how much farther impact goes, simply from a word change. So we went from invading our city to let's just love really well. Let's love our city so good. Same heart, different language. And I feel like what we're growing up in is we are learning as a body of the community and honestly, at largely at large, the body of Christ, is we are learning to articulate better our heart in seeing the kingdom of heaven come on this earth. So we're in this, we're in this uh, fascinating process right now, and I think 2016 is, is going to be just another step in this journey. We know that God's the master builder. He knows exactly what he's doing. How many are learning that God knows exactly what he's doing? We've always known that. We just keep knowing it more. So we know that God's building something. We know that he had plans, we, we, uh, a purpose for everyone. We, we understand all this. And so I, I, what I'm going to share today isn't so much just for this year. I think it's another building block for where we're going, for where we're headed, and for this house, and honestly, at large, the body of Christ. 